Famous Turkish author Cevat Şakir Kabaşlı, known as the Fisherman of Halicarnassus, said in one of his poems that whoever comes to Bodrum departed from Bodrum, leaving his mind and heart there, which summarizes the love of Bodrum. Identified with its whitewashed houses, brightened up colorful bougainvilles, Bodrum is one of the world's best-known holiday destinations, boasting sand beaches of crystal clear water and water sports of all kinds, as well as venues for art activities and a bustling nightlife. The Castle of St. Peter, built by the Knights of St. John, is one of the important places to visit in Bodrum. Built over a Celtic fortress, it also houses the Museum of Underwater Archaeology, the first and only in Turkey. The museum, featuring sunken material of thousands of years, is simply fascinating. One of the most impressive things to see in Bodrum is the mausoleum, the burial place of King Mausolus, who ruled Bodrum known as Halicarnassus in ancient times. Only the remnants of this 2,500-year-old edifice can be seen in Bodrum today. Musgebi, an old Lelek settlement, the castle of Aspat, Termera, Telmisos, Theangela, Kidney, Pedasa and Mindos are among the ancient sites in the peninsula. The windmills, which serve as the symbol of Bodrum and used from the 18th century to the 70s, overlook the peninsula and are among the interesting sites. Bardakçı, Gümbet, Torba, Bites, Bala, Aspat, Karayincir are many of the places where you can take your dip and sunbathe. Bites is the ideal place for surfing buffs. The biggest settlement of Bodrum, Turgut Reis, Küçük Çatal Island, is also a hot spot for windsurfers and a favorite shopping area with attractive sale items. If you go to Gümüşlük, which stands on the side of the ancient Karian city of Mindos, you can see the half-submerged remains of the ancient city and literally walk through the shallow waters of the sea to Tavshan Island and come back to Gümüşlük to treat yourself to a delicious dinner. The coast of Tilkecik Pasha Archbashi in Yalıkavak, renowned for its windmills, are good for swimming. Gündoğan, a relaxing place, and one of the early settlements of the peninsula, nestled in tangerine gardens. Tutbükü, used as a port by the Lycians, and Karada, accessible only by sea, as well as Maze, with its turquoise waters and lush green nature, are all worth a visit. The Blue Voyage is one of the indispensable elements associated with Bodrum. It is a kind of voyage which plunges you into the matchless beauty of Bodrum coves and readily proves to you how generous nature has been with this particular region. The Blue Voyage, as if designed to turn your dreams into passion, is a superb experience aboard Bodrum or Bosborn-built gulets, which gets you acquainted with not only the historical sites of ancient times where many civilizations reigned, but also a wealth of incredible beauties in which the blue of the sea embraces the green of nature. The voyages, varying between three days and one week, offer you a rich variety of choices in terms of routes depending on what you want to see so that you may delight in the pristine coast of this magnificent region. The stopovers at small islands for lunch and dinner enable you to savor the regional dishes of Turkish cuisine. With its historical texture carrying you to the civilizations of thousands of years ago, its natural assets, culture and hospitable locals, Mula ranks among the world's leading holiday destinations. Mula offers a multitude of riches, and that is why there exists a different mula for everyone to explore. We're inviting you to find out and savor the experience of a variety of beauties this unique part of Anatolia, the paradise on earth, offers. Tuzu, Moya, thank you.